Brothers and sisters, there are some sins that inshallah we will be speaking about shortly, which can also spoil our deeds. In the meantime, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has warned us and at the same time he has given us good news to say it is never too late you are breathing you can change your life watubu ilallahi jami'an ayyuhal mu'minuna la'allakum tuflihun and repent turn to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala O believers in order for you to achieve the mercy of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala brothers and sisters prepare for the day you are going to meet your maker for indeed that is a day that is evident it is a day that is coming without doubt brothers and sisters there is a misnotion that we live once so enjoy your life the reality is we live every day but we die once allahu akbar i want to repeat that brothers and sisters there is a misnotion that we live once so enjoy your life i would like to tell you that we live every day but we die once so make sure you've prepared for death brothers and sisters take account of your deeds before they are taken account of this was a statement that was often repent, uh, repeated by Umar ibn al-Khattab radiallahu anhu. And it is a very serious statement. Today we are very sure when it comes to the accountants, we make sure our books are in order. We make sure that everything is in order when it comes to accounting because those we work for might fire us if we did not have proper accounting of the records of the wealth in this particular world. Why don't we realize that there are far more important accounts when it comes to the deeds that we have done in order to present to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. May Allah grant us goodness. Brothers and sisters, one of the ways that deeds are spoilt is when we have done good deeds on one hand, but on the other hand, we do bad deeds as well. A person who engages in major sin and does not repent to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, if they die upon that condition, perhaps they may have spoilt many other deeds they have engaged in. A person who is musir ala sagheera, which means a person who continues to engage in a minor sin, considering it not important, perhaps they may be spoiling some other deeds of theirs because even if we engage in something bad, brothers and sisters, believe that it is bad. Believe that it is wrong. Understand, feel the remorse, feel the guilt, because feeling the guilt is a sign of goodness. It is only a true believer who will feel guilt when they do bad. But when we begin to do bad deeds and we feel no guilt, and we feel that we are defying our maker, perhaps we will be invoking the wrath of the Almighty, and perhaps we will be from amongst those, maybe, who may lose many more of our good deeds. May the Almighty grant us protection.